Mowgli was walking and crying through the woods. I couldn't believe it in first. This is way too early in the season for Row Farm. Nobody knows what happened to his mother. Mowgli immediately started bonding with myself. One and a half week later, I got a call about another deer. Baloo was born in the middle of the road and somebody had a car accident with a doe. An hour later, Baloo was laying in my room here. He was quarantined for the first three days and then I introduced them and they immediately started licking each other. It was love for the first sight or romance. The stories behind the deer were similar. In their eyes you could see pure happiness. It was also very special for me because for a long time I just had both of them. When they were about six or seven weeks old, I brought them into an outdoor surrounding. When they took their first step outside on real ground, they started to get wild. There were five other young fawns at my station last year, and it was the first time that they were a whole group. The deer played a lot in the first days. You could definitely see their energies were very different. Mowgli was more active and Baloo was very shy. But you could definitely see that Mowgli and Baloo were the most connected. They stayed in this habitat two and a half months. And then I opened the habitat door and said to them, now you're free, you can go and come back if you're hungry. This was another special moment because it was the first time for them being really free. When Mowgli started moving from one side of the environment to the other, Baloo followed him immediately. And if Baloo looked at something and thought, oh, this is scary, Mowgli joined him and it was very interesting. Even if I had only one of them on my wildlife camera, the other one joined about a minute later. So I really think it's kind of romance for them. They were kind of there for each other. I hope that they stay together for a long time. You never know if they find two girlfriends also very connected to each other. <laughs> Every two days, Mowgli and Baloo came back to have a good lunch. They were the best visitors, but they belong to wildlife to grow healthy and to be wild again.